Hello my friends, today we are going to make this movie detail page. There is this same main image component and there is uh, information about this movie, so title or runtime or this kind of information. And if we click this toggle after view, so um, there are clues for this movie. So this is what we are going to do in this video. So to make this page, First, we are going to fetch detailed information that belong to a specific movie. So we are going to so fetch all of the information about this movie. So after that, so we are going to put this data uh, inside the state. And then we will make this entire template briefly. And then we also fetch the tourist information that appear in this movie. Because when we fetch this information about the movie, uh, inside that information, uh, this one is not included. So that's why we need to fetch the data again for this course. So now we do this the first step. So by going to our text editor in here. So we go to movie detail page in here. So by using this use effect, delete here, delete here. So in here, we need to do fetch again as we did uh, in here like this so we are going to bring this one and put it in here and we also bring this configuration from here but end point is for getting all of the movie data but right now what we need to get is this one specific movies data so this endpoint needs to be changed into like this one, movie ID. So now we get this movie ID from here. So how can we get this one? So that is from like this props, match, params, and movie ID. So we need to put these props in here and we don't have the page here because it will be just the information for this one movie. So there is no page. So we delete it. Uh, this is the ways how we uh, fetch this one specific movie's information. So after doing it, we get we do then, and we will get the response from that API. And we need to make this response as JSON data, and we will do response again. And we will see which kind of data we will get from here by doing the load console load. So first I'm going to turn on this application first, npm run dev. So I'm going to turn on console panel and see the console panel here. There is object. So I got all of the data about this one movie titled the Star Wars. So this response was as we expected. So now we need to put this information inside the state so we need to make that state movie here by using same movie we put this response here so now what we need to do is so make a brief entire template in here first we will have this main image we can get this one from landing page here put it in here so maybe this one needs to be just movie and we also need to import this main image. And, and in here, we need to have this movie into table. We are going to use the entity design for the table. So I'm going to uh, bring that one in here. So and then I I will get it from the entity design here. Movie, 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 movie. And then now we need to have this toggle button. It will be very similar to this one. Now we come to this part. I need to change this position into the center. In center. And I need to bring this button from the entity design. This one too. Oh, now it's good. So now what we need to do is to the fast cruise information that appear in this video because the inside this 
video, this course information is not included. So that's why we need to fetch it again. Let's come in here. After being successful for getting this movie information, we want to get the information for the cruise. So we need to have one more this endpoint. So we need to copy this one and paste it in here. The parts we need to change is here first, thread this, and we need to delete this part. So this is all for getting the cruise information. So we also need to then again response and response and JSON and then response and we will make the one more state for storing that cruise information. User state cruise. So it will be array set cruise response. So we bring this cruise state and read card cards for cruise. So as we did in here, we are going to do the same things. We need to bring this role. Uh, we need to change this movies into cruise and cruise. And we need to yeah, import this grid card. Oh, we need to change this name into crew. Mm, crew. Like this. Our props need to be changed. So I first delete them. And first I give this after props to indicate this information comes from the movie detail page, not from the landing page. So to differentiate it, so I give this actor props. So because of this one, if we go to grid course, so we can do like this. If props and actor, we can, can do like this. And if it's not, we can do like this. So we come back to movie detail page again. We need to give more props. If we see here, there is an image for the cruise. We will have image again. So first, I will just do console log for this cruise information and then save it. Oh, so now we got errors. And the reason was I need to specify the crew here, crew after this response like this so i save it again the errors went away so so now we need to keep this props in here parties uh, so chris image is like this profile path we need to get this one so this we need to change this one into true and true and profile path profile path that uh, this is all for the props so we go to grid cards in here. So we are going to copy this part and paste it. So we don't need this link. So delete it. So save it. So in here, save it. So we go back to our application and we couldn't get this image. So what is the problem? Uh, if we see in here, we didn't give this for pass. We only give the pass for the image name so we come back in here so i need to go to landing page and i need to bring this one and then come back in here and paste it and save it and come back in here so now we got all of the images but there is some cruise which doesn't have a image so we are not going to get the persons the who doesn't have a image so we give these conditions only the person who has profile pass will get grid card like this and save it and come back in here uh, but it's weird we have four duplicated image and two duplicate when it was wrong maybe i need to find some problems mm -hmm. uh, maybe i need to change this one into cast uh, uh, maybe it was cast without s save it again Oh, uh, now it's correct. It, it was the cast, not crew. I'm sorry about that. So now the next thing we need to do is we need to make this function to toggle this one. We go to our button and in here, make the on click. 
event. So name will be handle click. So make this function in here const handle click. And we are going to make the state to control that. And name will be actor toggle. Initial value will be force. And set actor toggle here. Actor toggle. Like this. So we need to give the com condition for this grid car. Only when the actor toggle is true, we are going to render this part. Back in here, so I'm going to click it and then click it again to hide it so it works perfectly. So thank you for watching this video and see you in our next section. Thank you.